George Russell enjoyed a sensational start at the Spanish Grand Prix on Sunday, with help from an unlikely party. George Russell has revealed that the sensational move that took him from fourth on the grid to the lead of the Spanish Grand Prix was actually pre-planned the night before, and inspired by fellow driver Fernando Alonso's launch in 2011. The Mercedes driver lined up on the grid in P4 after losing out to teammate Lewis Hamilton in qualifying for just the second time this season the day prior. However, after getting a better start than his colleague, a path to the front opened up. As Pulsar Lando Norris and Max Verstappen squabbled over track position on the inside, Russell tucked into the slipstream on the long run down to turn one before jolting out to the left and swooping around the outside, clearing both the McLaren and Red Bull drivers before the exit of turn two. Explaining the thought process behind his move, Russell said, I was dreaming about it last night and what my plan of attack was going to be. I saw the weather forecast and the wind had shifted into a headwind into turn one, which I knew meant I could break really late and deep into the corner. When I was racing karts I always remembered watching Fernando in 2011 starting from P4 and getting into the lead. I knew it was possible. Russell's plan was then set in stone by some meticulous on the day research. I did four laps to the grid and practiced braking as late as possible on every single lap, so I knew where the limit was, he added. I knew how strong the wind was and I knew what was possible with the car, so it was calculated risk. It was satisfying to pull off. Despite his immense start to the race, when Russell took the checkered flag he was running in fourth place, the same position from which he launched. Despite his teammate picking up a much-needed podium for the team, the man from Kings Lynn struggled to hide his frustration. This, however, was not the view of his team principal. We can take a lot of positives away from today, Toto Wolff explained. We have taken several steps forward in the previous few races and it is good to see these confirmed here in Spain. We are not quite there yet, and we have to more to do to catch those ahead.